So, hey guys. So, back in November, I actually contracted COVID. And um, in this video that I'm going to show you, I actually went and had my um, COVID vaccine, my husband and myself. And um, I just wanted to tell you, like, day by day, things that had happened, um, different feelings or um, ailments or something that we would be having. But for the most part, I wanted to let you know that I have had COVID. You know, I was um, home for the 14 days, didn't feel good at all, couldn't breathe, the whole thing. I never got as far as being so ill that I needed to be <clears throat> hospitalized, but I did have friends and um, family members of friends who did have to be admitted to the hospital. Um, some whom did not make it through. So as for me, I felt that um, the vaccine, at first I was a little scared to get it, but then as for me, I felt as though it was something that I did need to do for myself, especially because of the um, career that I am in now. I'm around a lot of different people from different parts of the world. And so I needed, thought that I needed to um, protect myself. <clears throat> so right now I'm just gonna share with you my little journey. So just step inside my COVID stores. Thanksgiving and I'm just sitting here by my window and I'm admiring the outside and the wind and the leaves and just how beautiful it is and just want to say that I am thankful. Um, for those of you that know me, you know that I am mending from coronavirus. I did catch it. I'm not sure how I caught it because I thought I was pretty safe, but I guess you know, so like when I went to the doctor and they told me like I cried and I cried and I cried. But then as the days passed, I figured, you know, I can beat this. So that's what I worked on. So those of you that know me, you know that I travel like all over the United States. Sometimes I'm away from home for like seven months at a time. And for some reason, that is a lot different from being in quarantine in your room alone for like 14 days. No one comes in and you don't get to go out. Like you want to make sure that you don't get everybody else in the family ill. So it's like I learned a lot um, about quarantine I learned that I don't like it, but you know what? Some really weird things happened to me. So like, <clears throat> I had like a breathing problem, like something in my chest. Well, for some strange reason, um, I think that's what Corona had attacked first. So when I healed that from that, it's gone. Like I no longer have this weird breathing issue that I've had. So I am grateful to that. I know that but everybody I has like their different um, ailments and stuff like that. Mine, thankfully, were not as bad I know that there are some who ended up in like the hospital um, I did not have to go that route I was able to just stay home and medicate um, and get well that way but like being lethargic and extra tired and having no energy like I tried to make my bed up one day and thought I had been on like a 50 mile run like no breathing the whole thing but I am better I have mended I am back on the mend. Well, good morning, guys. Um, today is Tuesday, March 23rd. Um, I have my COVID um, vaccine today. And I am going to... I'm going to let you guys know... Um, just, you know, things that happened to me or whatever. Um, so yeah, I'm a little nervous, not gonna lie. This, at first I was the one saying that I wasn't gonna have it because I just didn't know enough about it. 
but a lot of my friends have had it already and um, they have not had a lot of, um, actually no one has had any adverse reactions, just the regular fever and stuff. So I'm gonna be heading out soon um, for the shot and I will keep you poster. So I'm here at um, Walgreens and I am waiting. I've already done my registration. So now I'm just waiting. Um, my appointment, however, was at 9.15. It is now 9.39, so I'm still just waiting. And um, the closer I think it's time for them to call my name, I keep breaking out in a hot sweat. <clears throat> Let's see how this goes. Oh no, he just called my name. Oh, it's my turn. Leave that for me, please. All right, guys, it's ready to happen. Oh, I do not like shots. Lord, I miss it. And how's your morning been so far? It's been good. Okay. It's been good. Yeah. And productive so far? Uh, this is the only productive thing I've done so far. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay. I think I should close my eyes. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna close my eyes. Oh, that's not bad. That wasn't bad at all. Wow. I overthought that one. <laughs> okay, so I had it. Um, now we have to wait like 15 minutes in the store or in the pharmacy just to make sure. Let me see, hold on. So that'll be 10 o'clock for me. So I'm just gonna walk around. See you in a minute. I'm just gonna walk around. No, I gotta see you get yours too. So 15 minutes, we have to stay. Now it wasn't, it wasn't bad. I'm one that does not like shots at all and I didn't even feel it. So that was pretty good. Um, so we have to wait about 15 minutes inside the store, like walk around and uh, see if we have any side effects maybe that make us dizzy or something. So I'm pretty sure that I won't. I just wanna eat because <laughs> I was too nervous to eat before. All right, guys, so it has been four hours, four, since I had my shot, and I feel absolutely nothing. So I'm not gonna start bragging right now, but I don't, let me see, where was it? Um, let me see. Mm. You can see the little spot, it's a little red around it, I guess. But nothing, nothing big. And um, yeah, so right now I'm still good. Four hours, haven't felt anything. I've been shopping, ready to do some house cleaning, all that kind of stuff. I will be back to tell you guys what I feel. See you then, until then. Get vaccinated. All right, guys. So today is day two of vaccine. And I have to say that I feel good. I feel great. Um, I have a little pain maybe, but you know, I can lift it up. I feel it. I know that I've had a shot, but it is good. Um, for me, no headaches, no fevers, um, no fatigue, no anything. So I think that I am on um, a good track and I don't think anything's gonna happen. So I said that I was gonna do this for three days and so tomorrow will be the third day and so I will come back and let you know if anything changes. I hope not. Today, I actually went to work, um, worked and didn't have any issues, none at all, just except for me having the, oh, 
you know, hide the shoulder from people. So they, cause they want to tap you. And, but other than that, everything was good. I know people were saying, oh, I feel like I got hit by a Mack truck or something like that. Mm -mm. Nothing for me. I feel great. Um, my next shot won't be until like April 13th or something like that. So we might have to come back and just see how that one does. But to let you know, the first one was a-okay. See you guys tomorrow. Hey guys, so this is the third day of COVID vaccine and um, I'm feeling great. I never got sick, never got a headache, um, was able to return to work the very next day, did a lot of, did shopping, did house cleaning. Well, not a whole lot of house cleaning, but anyways, yeah, so, um, wait, what arm was it? It was this arm, and the arm is, um, from the third day, a little, it, I wouldn't even say tender. I just, I don't know, maybe, like, it feels like I may have bumped it on something or whatever. It didn't leave any marks, I don't think. Oh, I think the shot was right there, but I'm not sure. But, yeah, so, that's the third day of the COVID vaccine watch, and... We did very well with that. So I think I told you already, we took the Pfizer. Um, we go back for our booster on the 20th of April. And um, if we have any like adverse effects from the second shot, which is what people say is the one that kind of has the issues, I will let you know. I don't know how you feel about the COVID vaccine, but... Um, I work in the public, and so I just felt that it was best for me to get that and to try to keep myself and my family safe. So, yeah. So, I'll let you know if anything goes awry or whatever. But until then, Okay, song. so, I know I said three days. Hey. I know we said three days, but we're going to go with four days. Four days. Four days. Did you get your vaccination, Jasmine? I have not. Are you going to go get it? Why don't you know? Because what if all you turn into guinea pigs? <laughs> <laughs> if I turn into a guinea pig, will you take me? I would definitely. Because I know you have the hairless guinea pig right now, don't you? You'll be my seventh one. Oh, my se oh I'm going to be her seventh yes. one. Yes. So, Jasmine doesn't know if she's going to take the vaccine. However, I took it already. So, we're going to see. I just got to make sure I don't turn into a guinea pig. I think you're already morphing into one. <laughs> <laughs> That's cold. <laughs> That's cold. cold. That's cold. That's cold. So yeah, yesterday was my third day. Everything was great. And today it's even better. Because so, it's your birthday. Oh my God. It is my birthday, but you guys can see I'm at work and I'm not having any problems. Because you're with me. Because I'm with her. All right, guys. So I will be signing out. No more vaccination talk. Until she gets hers, and then I'll let you guys know. I'll be like, hey, y'all, remember my friend Jasmine? Well, she got her vaccine. <laughs> Signing out for the vaccine talk until 21 days. See you guys later. Say bye, Jasmine. Bye.